Hi everyone. Well, I have got another outlet shopping from the glossy box. This is actually one that I did order, so I'm excited to open this up. See what's in here for the $7 because you never truly know what you're getting. It gives you the different variations, but you don't really know what you're getting. So anyway, I'm excited to open this up and I'm even more excited because you guys are here to join me. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Welcome for another Glossy Box Outlet Shop. Yeah, I know, I trusted them again. So anyway, I did get some credits because they had sent me the wrong box twice already for things that I didn't order. One was, a, two of them were, it was the same box that they had sent. And then another one was just, it was just a miss match of different items that were in there didn't, that didn't match any of the boxes on their site. They gave me like I think nine dollars credit. Once I saw that credit go through I ordered two of the boxes that I wanted again. I got those ones. You know what? They're the same ones that I didn't order. So now I've got four of those same boxes. So anyway, I tried again. This is going to be my last time trying. I ordered some more of the boxes. I got one in and um, actually I got two in and I got three still on back order. So don't know if I'm going to get them or not at this point. I really don't care as long as I give me my money back for the ones that I did order and they still have the outlet open. I just wish that um, if they know they can't fulfill that box that you're ordering, if they let you know it's a mystery box, just put on a mystery box. That way everybody's happy. If you get the same thing again and again, well, it's a mystery box. You don't know what it's going to get or, you know, some kind of apology that they're running out of stock and they're doing substitutions. I'm fine with that. But when you don't hear anything and it's up to you to try to call and make it right, that isn't to me, that isn't customer service. So be proactive when you don't have that stock and you're promising people that they can get these items and we're picking the boxes that we want. There's at least one item in there that we're like, yeah, I, I would really like to have another one of those. You know, I just think it, it's, it's fair for companies to be honest and upfront. But anyway, we did get this one. I honestly don't remember getting this one. I would have to go back at past videos, but I'm sure at one point I must have got this one. So anyway, I'm excited you're here. No more whining. You see, I don't have any wine here. I don't have any cheese. No more whining. Alrighty. So let's see what we got in here for $7. So I believe the this one, I think, does have a card, maybe. So when they did this one, they looked like they had like a zebra box that maybe you got. And then one the other, like the e cheater or leopard print one. Um, I don't think it tells. Does it tell us what's in here? And it does. So we'll see if these are the items that are in here or not. Alrighty, and the packaging is really, really pretty. So we got this kind of gold that matches the cheetah print on top. We got the seal. We got the little black ribbon here. Alrighty, things are looking good. Now, of course, when you do it, they tell you there's different variations that you can choose, but then you don't know which variation you're choosing. So I picked one of both. So I'm hoping I get the one with the zebra print too, even if it's the same thing, because at least it's what I ordered. Alrighty, so let's open this up. This is what it looks like in here. Yeah, I still don't remember this one, but you know, I'm old. I'm old and it could have been a couple of years ago that this one came out. Alrighty, so the first thing that's in here is an Ico and this is a liquid eyeliner in black, big and bold. So our easy to handle chubby pen delivers big bold lines. I don't know if there's an expiration date on here or not. But if it hasn't been opened, maybe it would still be good. I know our daughter Raina was saying she's been having trouble looking for the perfect liquid eyeliner. So this might be something she would be interested in getting a little surprise package. And it does come in a container like this. Alrighty, so we are going to leave that closed. We're going to leave it intact. And uh, I don't think Raina watches me too often, so hopefully this will be a little surprise for her. Alrighty, and what does it say about this Ico, the fat liner? Um, this was a full-size product, 
and I had a value of $22 already, and I paid $7. All right, so next is a Bella Pierre. It's a kiss-proof lip cream. And it just says 40s red. This is more than likely a full-sized item, and it is. And the value of this was $20. All righty, and this is probably going to be too dark for me because I, you know, let's face it, I'm a wuss when it comes to lip color. Yeah, oh boy. Yeah, this is very, very dark. And of course, you know, lip glosses may not go on the color that you see. It might go on lighter, but yeah, this, this is dark. Okay. But anyway, it's a nice value, so I'm sure somebody will love this. Alrighty. Yeah, my lip. One thing about lip gloss, when you have lip gloss on, your hair sticks to it, whether it's dry hair or wig hair. Alrighty, so this is by Steve Laurent. Comes in this nice outer packaging here that matches the box. And this is an eyeshadow palette. Nice black case, gold lettering. And it does have a mirror, so let's try to cover that mirror so we can show you the colors in here. So again, we've got nice neutral, but we got that nice kind of coppery rose color. We've got that kind of bluish black down at the bottom. So it is a, a pretty palette. I think you can get some really nice looks out of this. So this, this is a nice little palette here. Um, this is also a full size. So there's been three full sizes in here. And this has a value, I think it says $38. Alrighty. Yeah, so this was a really good box. You think if I got it, I would have remembered. Got the little color saver right there. Yeah, so this is nice. I am liking these items so far. Next, and I love Elemis. This is Pro Collagen. It's a cleansing balm. I love, love, love cleansing balms. I am finishing up some Elemis cleansing balm now. This is a travel size. And the MSRP on this is $14. And again, I do love the cleansing bombs. They just feel so, so nice. It's really not any scent in here. You can see it's pretty full to the brim. And the cleansing bombs are just, they just kind of get your makeup off before you even add water. So you just kind of start rubbing it. I rub it a little bit in my hands, kind of get it warm up. Then I start rubbing it over my face, like my chin, my nose, my cheeks, my forehead. And then lastly, I'll just kind of go over my eyes with that and then rinse it off with some warm water. And yeah, easy, easy peasy. Your skin just feels so hydrated after. So going to enjoy that. Next, we've got a face mask, and it looks like there could have been a choice of three in here. And the value of this is $6.99, so this one is a charcoal face mask. It's purifying and brightening. So that was everything that was in this box, I think. Had I got this box last year or the year before, I know I would have been impressed with it. And since it had this, it probably would have... <coughs> would have been about two years ago. Sorry about that. I'm still trying to get over cold. Um, so anyway, we got this mask, value of $6.99. We got this travel size Elemis, this cleansing balm. Love, love, love this. This was $14 value. We got this lip gloss from Bella Pierre, which is a brand that Glossy Box uses quite a bit. And that had a value of $20. It is a deep red color, a little too bright for me. So that will probably go in a future giveaway. This palette is so pretty. Steve Laurent. I love the packaging of the box as well. This was a full size item and it was a value of $38. It really does have some nice colors in there. And then the last item was another full size item. This was the liquid line liner line liner and this chubby kind of handle and this had a value of $22 so not a bad box at all I wouldn't mind if I knew I would get this box again I would order it and just do it as a giveaway on that one box but just to show you what that um, liner looked like with the chubby handle there so that's uh, something easy to handle with your hands maybe and yeah so take your time, rest your elbow on the table, and draw your liner gradually. You know, I could do it that way. I could. But anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for stopping in, spending some time with me. 
I am then going to enjoy the items that I keep from this box. Yeah, and then the others will be like giveaways or future things like that. But yeah, it was a really great box. Enjoy going to enjoy this one. I and if it's still on the website, I might try to get another one just to do as a giveaway because it is such a good value. Alrighty, so I want to thank you guys again for stopping in, spending a few minutes of your day with me. I appreciate you guys so much. You guys, you guys are amazing. Thank you again from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel, please take a quick second. Hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love for you to come back and join us for future videos. Your comments, of course, are always welcome. And I hope you give my video a thumbs up. I hope everyone goes out and has a fabulous, fabulous day. The rest of your week or weekend. I never know when I'm going to get a chance to post these. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life have some fun. I love you guys so much and we will see you in our next video. Bye-bye.